Grand Rising. This is Urban T tapping in. And Noah bring you the info. Love, love, my nation is how are y'all doing? I am doing great. Hope y'all doing great. Let's get to this article. We got a couple pet peeves. And pet peeves for y'all too. Some of y'all out there. But anyway, we all love animals, right? Some exotic and some basic, like cats. My best friend, he uh, loves cats. Personally, I can't stand cats, and I'm allergic to them. I just found out recently. And my, it's funny, I got traumatized by my friend's cat too, over his house one time. Still traumatized to this day. So, but I came, um, came across these articles, and it's about dogs. People are losing their limbs due to dog infectious bacteria. It is called, oh, I pronounced this right, Capnocytopica. I'm gonna say it again, Capnocytopica, which is a negative bacteria that resides in dogs' and cats' mouths. It is transmitted by dog bites and is usually life-threatening. People who are immune deficient and getting symptoms uh, rapidly then worsen. The treatment is transvenous, uh, I'm sorry, intravenous fluid medication to raise low blood pressure, dialysis, or other methods to clean the toxins from the blood, or amputation to control gangrene. Yeah, you get gangrene. And it depends on uh, the severeness of the situation. And in this one incident, an Ohio woman named Marie Trainer, who called out of work feeling nauseous and having back pains, getting back from a vacation. Then her body temperature rose and dropped back down, which led to her being in an emergency room, waking up in a hospital bedroom for uh, pretty much nine days with her legs, hands, amputated so the doctor discovered that trainer had a severe infection not from a tropical disease but from her own dog she has a uh, german shepherd that licked her but not just licked her it licked her uh on a cut a wound that she had uh prior so i'm gonna put the turn of video on and you're gonna uh pretty much see what's going on so i'm gonna turn that bad boy on so i'm gonna put it up now ah magic <laughs> So let's see. Normal after losing her hands and legs yeah. because of all things a dog lick. Marie yeah, Trainer woke saying. up from a ten day coma to find her limbs had been amputated. I cried. Mm -hmm. I when she uh I'm gonna say this, when, when she passed I out consciousness from the disease, her skin started turning, as you see in the video, it started changing later, uh, rapidly, Marie turning purple, reddish, uh, reddish colors, and progressed to gangrene, her also developing blood clots and spreading from the tip of her nose it turns to her out. legs, face. And I think she did have surgery on her face a little bit. Now most people who get in contact with dogs and cats, they usually don't get uh sick. And it's really rare to cause the illness in humans. I think it's like a one in a million. I think it's, then he did say one in a million. I can't remember. Don't quote me on it. We, do your own research. But um, to a weak immune systems, like having a, a cancer patient, those who get sick, yeah. And then the symptoms start like that, like up to three to five days with the quickness. So um, now, uh, kind of like I said in, uh, previously, the research is rare disease. But um, I have some issues with uh, with pet owners. I do have pet, uh, issues with pet owners. And some of y'all out there, I'm calling y'all out, whoever y'all are, y'all get too intimate with y'all pets, okay? Real intimate, y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all be sleeping with y'all pets, kissing them, letting the animals lick y'all and kiss y'all. And in some cases, I ain't, gonna, I ain't saying y'all, but in some cases, having sex with pets. And I did an uh, article a while ago on, uh, this is crazy, goat sex rings. Yeah, there's some out there's some weirdos out there. And yes, I'm an animal lover too. And uh but you know, that's it is it's crazy that he, that we we dealing with this, but some of y'all really need to um pretty much just to tone it down a little bit, okay? I think we got the, I think they're showing too many of these commercials with animals running around and all that, like like I said, because we like all these different kind of diseases are getting spread by animals and us being close to them all the time that kind of um it changes everything it changes the dynamic and the stuff can jump from one animal to another but like i said i ain't no scientist i'll do your own research but this is in this case there's a couple i ain't show there's a couple more cases that happen i just showed you this one so just be more aware and be careful like i said dogs mouths ain't clean i know who told you that what was that one that one saying a dog mouth is cleaner than the humans. That's a darn lie. And the human's mouth ain't all that great either. So, um, 
Like I said, like, share, subscribe, get us popping, get us going, get the mojo going, and a third party. I'm out of here. Peace. My nation is salute. AM to the PM, 3 PM. Plant the seeds, water them, and let the trees stem. News, information, and knowledge. Water with enough that can save your sons and daughters. Digging through this wicked world. Crack the shell and get the pearl. Ready for anything they will hurl. Die standing, then living on your knees. With the targets on your back. Coming from the bottom of the roots. We got you. Third party is the truth. Hitting you with the real thoughts and info questions. You be laughing out your shoes and boots. Sit down and watch Third Party Nation. Stand and salute. Woo!